Hello YouTube, Infinite Imaginary Community. Christmas is just around the corner. We are one week away and we are now starting the Christmas party event. Let's check out all the goodies in this particular, um, uh, in this, this coming week. It's actually almost like a two week event, I believe. So we will take a quick look at all the possible deals they have and figure out, you know, what should we focus on what's worth it and what's not. Of course, there's a limited hero. We'll talk more about that as well. So first of all, there is this Christmas party event. Uh, looks like it's just one week, but there's also this Christmas cyan holiday uh, for two weeks. So it looks like we're going to get something for the week of New Year as well. But the first week is Christmas party. Um, so surprise gift. Can be purchased and claimed seven times if you get these packs. So first one's free. Okay, thank you. This one's for a thousand gems. So we get lucky coupons. Oh, we'll figure out what lucky coupons are for. These are for the feature gifts. So how do we get these? These are through the value packs. Okay, you get... Okay, so in the special packs, I think you get... You get one extra value badge. And do we get other value badges here? Okay, there's another three here. So that's that's $35. Okay, let's see what we got here. So the first one, you get two summons. Okay, the last, last one's for deluxe gift. Okay, so if you purchase this, this means you get, so what does this mean? Okay, so for a thousand gems, you get these coupons. We'll figure out what the coupons are for shortly after, but you get this much summons every day. Here for, for $5, you're getting 35 summons and you're getting these bells. Okay, so bells, oh, so many different currencies, right? Really hard. They're, and as many of you who probably, if you ever watched videos on, you know, how do gotcha games make money, is to create so many different currencies that you lost track of what is the sense of money uh, for these various things. So since it's gems, we're, we'll get it. Is it worth it, a thousand gems? It depends on what these coupons are for. So let's take a look at what the coupons do. So next one's lucky number. So these coupons allow us to play slot machine. Oh my God. Can this be any more gacha? Uh, okay, so looks like from the resource store, we're allowed to buy four. So clearly we're going to go for them. But from these uh, chests, it looks like you can get all of the limited hero from these chests. All the past ones. Um, hang up, Big Jack. So value-wise, very big value if you can get these for $99 each. Very big value. Um, so you are, you're going for total points and when you reach a certain amount of points, you get, you, you get rewards and for the number of slot machine coupons you use, oh boy. So you get a guarantee Santa at at 80. I think this should be manageable because you start with 10, right? You start with 10, then you get 28 more from the from the shop. So you're at you're at uh 38. So if we then go back to the Christmas present here, you got you got 7 here. You got you got 14 here. So let me just quickly grab a calculator. And figure out how many we're at. So, so we're at 28 plus uh, 10 plus here plus 14, and we we get another seven here, right? We get seven plus seven. For Santa, you need 21 more. So, um, so if we were to go get it from the shop, one dollar. So I need 19 more. Okay, plus another five, 
that makes 5 and 10. That's that's 14, right? That's 15 plus 2, 17. That's odd. 21. It feels like something's off here because normally, right? Normally the game is set up, again, they always try to make it so that you're just a little bit shy. Just a little bit shy. Um, so you're going to be at, I think, 76 after spending $16 for that Santa. Um, again, compared to most stuff, it's really cheap. Um, let's see to get to the first choice box how far we'll be at. Um, yeah, you're going to be buying these. You can only buy 10 is granted at the beginning. Yeah. So let's go to resource store. Sorry. And then flash pack. So most likely you need to grab one of these. But if you get a 60. Okay, so the 60s are going to basically $100 for every limited hero after that. So so roughly that's the cost. Um, again, the choice is sort of like if you're looking for any of the limited hero you haven't gotten yet. Um, every 60 for the first two. Oh, 60, then you need 80 more. So it's about $100 for the first one, then maybe 120 for the next one, and so on and so forth. Then it gets really expensive. It gets a lot more expensive. So the first one, the second one, maybe a little bit better value than trying to summon from Miracle Runes. Because again, Miracle Runes, if you haven't saved up or you have a lot of gems for it, it gets very expensive. Next thing is is uh, Bell Exchange. Oh boy, uh, more exchanges. Okay, so you get special rewards there okay so first one's free so based on the number of bells you have you could pick up different packs this one you get the echo pack this one you get a really good choice of solid heroes for 68 and you can buy one of them uh, 30 for the particular chest so special rewards If all the products in the shops are exchanged, then you get uh, this legendary echo plus the other one. Now to get all the bells, we go back here, right? So you get you get 21 bells here, and you get another seven, so 20 20 bells. But how many bells I have? I have zero right now. So uh, more 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 spending, huh? Um, wonderful. I wonder, do you get bells in here? Do you get bells from the event? Yes, you do. So total point reached 800, you get five more bells, but we haven't figured out how much bells we get. So here, let's let's just spend 10 for the heck of it. So we get a sense of, okay, so we got 10 rows so far, and we are at, 107 points. So if theory is correct, you get to 50 or so. I mean, if let's just say you do 80 and get close to that Santa. 80 rows is going to probably be able to help you finish this point goal system. Yeah, you're going to be able to finish the goal and you get a guaranteed uh, epic one. And what's nice is you get a full slate set. And these slate sets, unfortunately, don't come with pre-attributes. So uh, don't get too excited about them. Um, all right, so uh, on to on to other goodies. Okay, Miracle Wish goes. Okay, so we'll do a separate video on uh, on Jingle Bell, but that's the new limited hero. Limited time dungeon. Okay, uh, I will work on the guide right after I post this video. But over here, we can look forward to our uh, legendary dragon eye. So I will do that shortly if you haven't got it yet. Holiday packs. Okay, special packs. Extra value exchange. Um, did I miss it? No, that's the two. That's the four. Anyways, um, again, don't look. They don't look super enticing, um, but maybe they have something like Black Friday, uh, Boxing Day. Who knows? So those are the holiday packs, value packs. Uh, we do have a good deal. Okay. And this is very similar to good deals in the past. Now, if you do plant, 
and I hate the fact, I think, oh, I, oh great, they, they freaking make you buy it as, sorry for swearing, um, I don't know if that counts as swearing or not, uh, but if, uh, yeah, they force you to buy it in order, so unless you need all of them, like, I know for people with some miracle runes, right, you go through all of them, but really, like, we're getting rune selections, I mean, a lot of people are able to farm like 28, 29, 30 now. And we have double double faction abyss on this week. The value for this is really understated. So remember, you have to buy all of this before you get to here. So think cautiously. It is about, I think, what? It's $245, right? For all of this. Not exactly cheap to, to get, get it. Yes, it's cheaper than probably buying Miracle Runes on its own. Yes. But most of us, I will recommend... Given how they're doing these events to get a limited hero to come back, again, well, I'll, I'll do the evaluation on how good the limited hero is. You know, is it worth it to have it for maybe at exclusive three or higher than other people in the first couple of weeks? Sorry, first couple of months or get it later? Like, it's really up to you, right? I mean, I got a guaranteed from my miracle there um, and I got some summons. Uh, luckily, in, if I'm lucky, we're looking at E2. If we're unlucky, we're looking at E1. I mean, it's what it is. I'm not going to, you know, break the bank on this. Um, I did talk about it in the spending video. Usually, these are not exactly a good deal. Just because for purchasing these, you're really just getting uh, a few five-star eggs and some supreme rooms is the key one. Now, if you do value them a lot, um, to me, because how easy it is to get food now, and these summons are supreme summons, I think, what, you get one, two, three, four, five for $20 I, versus, you know, your your regular battle pass. I mean, again, it, it's cheaper than buying, like, the, 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 the flash packs for sure, but... Um, Again, it's it's not exactly on the you know top list of my you know to buy deals. Okay, there you have it. Um, we don't actually have. I was hoping for more events than just a whole bunch of sales. Kind of disappointed actually. Um, there is no special dungeon, right? All of these exchanges are are, are sales. It's all sales. Come on, this other than the limited dungeon and the miracle wish. Yeah, it's kind of disappointing. I'm, I'm really hoping the second week with the New Year event, New Year event, we get a little bit more exciting. Yes, yes, the holiday sign is nice, but I was hoping for a little bit more excitement for the free to place. Um, there you go. Here goes my first impression for this holiday event. Um, I really like the thanks. I think it was the was it the Thanksgiving one or there was one. Oh, oh no, it was new. I guess that was anniversary. Anniversary really was good. Like the the. The events and the sales and everything from anniversary was really good. Black Friday was good. Christmas, maybe maybe they kind of got our expectation up too high. Um, just slightly, just a tad little disappointed. Um, but, you know, um, there's a second part of it by the looks of it. At least there's a second part. I hope there's a second part. Um, they will announce it later, probably in the patch on Tuesday. So look forward to my video coverage on that. I'll catch you guys in the next video um, as I quickly blast through the dungeons. I'll see you in the next one. Gandalf out.